What's up everyone? Welcome back to the channel. I know I haven't made a video in I you mean you may have watched one earlier this week, but I haven't been keeping up at all. And I got to I got to get kind of caught up. And I still have as you can see here, maybe maybe you can see. There's three inner gulag inner gulactics left. So you want to know what? We're going to do something we've never done on the channel before. We're going to open all three. Yes, you heard me. We're going to open all three. So this could be a long one. I'm going to try to do this as quick as possible. Not really going to go through the characters. We're just going to try to pull the, uh, the greens aside. And I can go through this at the end and find all the, the subset ones. The space farce and whatever other one there, there is in that. But hopefully... Hopefully, because we haven't found a sketch yet. So we're going to see if you do get a sketch out of a case. Or maybe a plate. or may who I don't know. Listen, guys, we're just going to open. We're going to see what it yields. And we'll go with that. So the, I think is it the last one? Yeah. So the time warps. Time warp here and the burger green there. That's how we're going to do this. And then we'll set any hits off to the side. That one's one. That one's one. That's how we're going to do it. The weather is changing. I don't know what it's doing, but it's... It's doing something. The space and a green. I don't know what the weather's like in your neck of the woods. So feel free to tell me. Oh, that is a time warp. Time warp and a green. Man, this is going to be a lot of cards. But I'll finally be able to go through these and pull out a set base. This is a space farce and a green. I think on average uh, for the intergalactics we have been pulling it's been one blue and one gray per hobby box. Uh, that's what the average is. But I don't know. We'll see. If you guys were rooting for me to pull something good Let's hope that we were able to do, that we're able to do that here. I don't know. Keep your fingers crossed. Let me know what you think about the long video. That's a space farce one. And the, as I was told by Mr. Stokes, that the space farce ones are by Tom Bunk. And that's why they're kind of darker. And it was the same way in, uh, it wasn't vacation, was it? Was it vacation? I can't remember. But I do have the puzzle of that signed by him. So that's cool. And I didn't check to see if any of those were time up. Whatever, I'm going to have to go through them. Off camera anyway. Oh, here we go. Here's a gray. Wiped will. That's a that's a cool one to pull. And then a space farce and a booger green. So there's the gray. Oh, what's it numbered? Numbered forty two of one ninety nine. Base and a green. <clears throat> Maybe I'll give you guys an update when I'm done <clears throat> to see what, how many, oh, there's blue. We got a blue Steve Starfighter, and this is numbered, it's not numbered there. Where's the number? What? Oh, there it is. 85 of 99. And a time warp 
and the booger green. Okay, I gotta, I gotta rearrange, guys. Just bear with me for a second. Okay. That's better. So we've already gone halfway through the box and we have pulled the basic hits out of there. Let's do that. We got a space first and a book of green. Just some base cards and a booger green. Try to keep the nose hairs in so you guys can see it. I know you guys like the nose hairs. Oh, they think that's a time warp. And a booger green. Actually, I just shaved my face and tried to take care of the nose hairs pretty good. The older you get, the crazier, the crazier the hair in your nose will grow, and the crazier your the hair in your ears will grow. As weird as that is, I think it's mostly for guys. Women just, I don't know, they stay pretty forever, and guys just age like I don't know, not well, I guess. Not sure. No, that's just base and a green. We're hoping out of these three we can pull something good. There's a time warp. Time warp. Booker Green. Base. Alright, we got a space force. Booger Green. You do not pull a set of Booger Greens out of a case, but uh, I have came. I don't think I have any doubles as of yet. Is that a? No, nope, that's nothing. Uh, so far, I haven't pulled any doubles. Um, we'll see what happens after these three boxes. There's a time warp. And a booger green. I should have a few of the sets of those subsets when we're done with these three, which will be nice. That's nothing. There we go. We got Space Force and a booger green. And the last pack. Took us eight minutes to do this. Not terrible, I guess. Just base and a booger green. Okay, there's box one. On to box two. Ripping like a madman. Not sure if I should wait to do videos and just do it like this. I don't know. You guys tell me. Do you want videos more often? So, like, you know, just stick with the, you know, hobby box at a time? Or do you guys want longer openings? More, more, just more packs? I don't know. I don't know. You guys are going to have to tell me what you want. Time warp. Put it cream. Do I just quit the channel? Tell me that. I'm a big boy. I can handle it. Because we still have plenty more stuff to open. It's a base and a booger green. You guys let me know.
Okay, we got a gray carved carter. This is going to be numbered 173 of one. It should be a 199. Kind of hard to see the one, but I do believe it is a one. That's a time warp and a booger green. So far, we have had just average boxes. Space farce and the booger green. And believe it or not, uh, I'm going to have to fix all the space farces because they're all upside down. But if they're sideways, you don't notice, which is actually going to take me into one thing that I did want to talk about when you're sleeving. And I'm just going to go really quick here. So when I sleeve cards, I always keep the number on top. And in order to do that, as you can see, the number's not on top there. This way, the number is on top. So that was upside down for me, but I'll go through them and I'll get it right. I like to keep all my numbers up on top when they're in their penny sleeve. And if they go into a top loader or if you're putting them in a binder, whatever you're doing, that's my little tip. I would suggest making sure that your numbers are always on top. Then this way, if you're ever looking uh, through your cards to find something for someone, it's not hidden on the bottom. So we're going to flip that one around. And there's the booger green. I'm really hoping that we pull a sketch out of here. I've not had luck with the hobby box cases. This is the, as far as the, you know, the big sets go, the 200 card sets. Uh, we opened one of, oh, what was that? Was it vacation? Um, no. Uh, what was the, dude, I can't even remember what case we had opened now. I don't think it was vacation. But regardless, uh, I opened one and there was like no luck, but that was a super printed set. This set wasn't printed. They didn't print. Uh, nearly as much as this as they have the other sets in the past. But this only came in hobby slash retail and collectors. And the funny thing with this is, is that you get heavy. If you bought hobby boxes, you get heavy with, I think it's A. Or is it B? I think it's, I think you get heavy on the A side. Oh, no, 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 that was right. That's the base cards. Okay. See, this is what happens when you try to open a ton of stuff real quick. I don't know. I'll be going through all this stuff again anyway. So I'm going to pull our blue for this box. Still haven't pulled it. And then the last card always slips through my fingers. So there's that. I don't know, guys. I don't know, maybe I should put some music on in the background. Been trying to keep a lookout for autos. I haven't seen any of those. I think they do have the foil autos in here. Those were really cool. There's our blue. Macho Monty. And this is numbered 64 of 99. There we go. And a booger green. 
So we got the normal stuff. Did we get any special stuff? I don't know. And there's a blue dot right there. I don't know. AI Adam is a time warp and a booger green. I think, I think in this, they did actually have a couple that were, um, where they signed the subsets, I think. Tell me if I'm right or wrong. You guys are watching and listening. Three, two, one. Oh, oh man. Oh, guys, let's put that booger green down. Oh, and we got a Jasmine Cointus. Oh, and that's green. Oh, man. A Grim Jim in space. Oh, oh, boy. Let's set that down. I'm going to let you guys look at that for a second. Like it oh do I like it in the green greens my favorite color oh man let's just let's just set that right there we pulled a sketch we finally did it and I just thought that was an auto at first there's a time warp and a booger green I really did I just was going through and I saw the autograph on the bottom didn't even think that it was a sketch we got a good box finally 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 and base that now and it almost it, of course it was gonna wait until the almost last box of course it was it's right there <laughs> all right Save some of these packs to put in with the with the full sets. Let's see, this is the last box out of the case. We got a time warp and a booger green. I am gonna, as long as I have like most of the set, if I'm only missing a few cards for the Booger Greens, I am just gonna probably buy them off of Facebook or not. Why does that one seem? Oh, just felt thick. I guess. Ooh. 
Come on back to Earth. There we go. Get it. Open. Intergalactic. Come back to Earth. Anyways. Listen, we pulled a sketch, guys. I'm so excited. Oh, that's a time warp. And a booger green. It's my first Jasmine, I do believe, to pull her sketch. Oh, there's a gray. And it's fantastic. I like that. Number 99 of 199. Kind of like that, too. And a Space Force and a Booger Grain. So that was a good case to open. I may. I may. I don't know. I may dive deeper into the research Possibly by another case of intergalactic, maybe? Just to see if we get a sketch of her. Let me know what you think of that. Or should I quit the channel? Or should I keep doing little videos? Or do long videos of like three? And then this way a case of comes in a case eight eight comes in a case now I think I could do just you know two hobby boxes per and that would shorten this down we'd be done already at 21 minutes we'd have been done just rip right through the stuff and see what all we have Green. Surprised the cat's not in here trying to uh, jump on my shoulders. He's been doing that a lot lately and he just likes to stay up there. There's a cyborg Billy, which is a time warp. And a booger green. I swear that card reminds me of the Princess Bride movie. I'll show you. Wasn't there a guy in Princess Bride that kind of looked like that? There was. Type in as you wish. Alright, we got a Space Force and a Booger Green. Still need to pull a blue. I Listen, I'll take... At this point in time, I'll take whatever. Some base and a booger green. The final countdown of the last tag of the last box. Yeah, that is. That's a time warp, and there's a booger green. Another Space Force and a Booger Green of the Power Rangers. Didn't really watch that show. I think I was just a hair too old for it when it came out. Base and a Booger Green. We're going to be coming up to our blue here sometime shortly. Oh, we got a gold nuclear Walter. I think that's a good one to pull. That's going to be numbered. Numbered 22 of 50. We'll stick that up there. And we also got a time warp and a booger green. So we got a gold. We just need a blue out of here. And that'll be, that'll be good. Uh-oh. I think 
have extras, so I, I don't know. We'll see. That booger green looks like it might have been a double of something. Some base, booger green. Here's our blue. We got Predator Prescott in the blue, which is numbered 35 of 99. A Time Warp and a Booger Green. Green. For my packs, opening this has made my fingers get like not sticky, but they're there's no moisture in them anymore. Booger green. But it's okay. Because we got that. about it. I am happy, happy, happy. That's a time warp. Time warp. Booger green. Last two packs. My expectations are low, but I'm happy. I am a happy, happy guy. That's a space force and a booger green. Last pack. Just some base and a booger green. So, out of the three boxes, we did finally pull a sketch out of a hobby box. Yes, and a good one, too. Love the color on that. Love the... Love the... Uh-oh. Forgot they're magnetic. They stick. Love the sparkle on there. It doesn't show on camera as much as it does in person, but it's gorgeous. Put that there. Stack of base, base, base. There might be some time warps or space forces mixed in there. I don't think space force, but whatever. I'll go through those. Bunch of greens. We got some blues, some grays. That gold right there. And some Space Forces. I'm happy with this. I don't mind doing the longer videos. If you guys want to watch me do that. If you want to see the shorter videos. If you don't want to see videos. Whatever. Comment if whatever I was talking about. Hope you guys have a good one. We'll see you in the next one.